Hello ladies and gents, I am the Rev. Welcome on back to more Warhammer 40k Space Marine with Captain Titus. And in this episode, we finish everything up. We take on the big bad mofo himself and see if we can pop his head like a zit. So, kick back, relax, hit that like button, subscribe to the old channel. Let's get some. I've encountered unexpected results. The warp energies affect different species in different ways. Essentially, I can tune this weapon to cause maximum damage to whatever enemy we face. If humans are caught in the blast wave, they will not be harmed. The dark gods have taken us! Slip in two days. Warp device strongly is from my side of shield. I need rest. What the hell? Out of fuel, huh? <clears throat> All right. Well, let's see what we see. There we go. Now I got all my tools. Kind of. Weapons better, but I think I enjoy this one. Yeah. 
Sit down, boy. You gotta get some. <laughs> Excuse me, jeez. Ooh. And that looks like Oh, excuse me. Like a fight arena or something. Fill up on all our ammo. You challenged me to recover this fragment of your power. And I have done this. The slaves of the false emperor who dared claim it as their own. I return your dark relic to you. I offer up this world and all those upon it. I ask for the reward that was promised. You want to talk to your guards? I will send you to them. Admitted, Titus. The power of chaos is within you. Calling to this relic. Imagine the ultimate dominating this galaxy in glorious conquest with you at their head. Imagine the power you could wield. As a slave to chaos, nothing you say could tempt me from the path of honor or from avenging the deaths of my battle brothers. You are no threat to me now, Ultramarine! Come here, big boy. Oh, I can't go through that. Ah. Show this fool the true nature of power. Destroy them! Here, okay, get our shield back up. Oh, look at that. They, uh, they flanked me.
Where'd the other one go? Your pathetic Imperial forces will be scoured clean from this world. Soon, my entire invasion fleet will cross into this reality. Titus, I have the will of the Dark Gods behind me, but you, you have no one, and you will die here, alone. Ooh, that's a buffed up version of him, crap. Killing my servants matters little. I am unassailable. The gods of chaos protect me with the very energies of creation. You forget, Nemeroth. I am no stranger to the touch of the war. Really? I gotta have a quick time event? <laughs> oh my god, really? Will you be joining us soon? Brother. Look there, Ultramarine. You 
have saved this world. I see the Ultramarines are human, after all. More than you know, Lieutenant. Uh, not really. Not with that gene seed in the back carapace. These guys got two or three extra little doohickeys versus regular Space Marines, too. Uh-oh, here we go. Back Templar. Ooh. Inquisition is here. His injuries appear chaos inflicted. You are certain of this charge? Captain Titus has been corrupted by chaos, Inquisitor Thrax. Oh, what a douchebag. I am no heretic. You lie! Only an agent of chaos could withstand such warp exposure. I sent the demon to oblivion. But did you have unholy assistance? We must know. You will submit to my authority, Captain, or the Inquisition must conclude that you have corrupted every Ultramarine under your command. Not to mention those who stand at your side. Ah, oh, and that's how shitty the Inquisition is. Ignore his threats. Come on. Now. The Inquisition will destroy you, Mira. And the Ultramarines will be forever dishonored. Now. Leave my brothers and the Lieutenant alone. I will come with you. I do not know why I can resist the touch of chaos, but I swear I will discover the truth. We will discover many truths, Space Marine. Codex Astartes leaves no room for doubt. You cannot touch the warp and emerge unscathed. The Codex Astartes is a set of rules. They guide us, shape us as Ultramarines, teach us to hold duty and honor sacred above all. But how we live with those rules is the true test of a space marine. And you have failed. So you gotta carry out that badass weapon. Yeah, but Rabute Gilliman wrote that. That's why there are no more legions. They only told her a thousand space marines per chapter now, if I remember correctly. Oh, it was dedicated to someone. Oh man. Rest in peace, brother. Well. The game is a little short, but it did not disappoint. Fucking loved it. Every one of these first or third person ones that come out, I always, always play them. If I can get my hands on them. If I remember 
Uh, look at the playlists. Maybe I'll throw in some of the uh, Terminator armor stuff. Uh, Space Hulk, I think. The one where we get to use the Terminators. And that's a first person point of view. I like this better personally. I like swinging the axes, all that stuff. But I cannot wait for Space Marine 2. So, keep your heads down. Your chain swords of doom up, brothers and sisters of the Imperium. And I'll see you again real damn soon.